It's a very nutritious plant and its benefits have been acknowledged by nutritionist dietitians and nutrition researchers. Considered a miracle plant, the tea derived from the leaves of this tree has high levels of flavonoids or polyphenols. These are antioxidants that can help detoxify your body and strengthen the immune system. We are lucky enough to have malunggay or moringa tea in our backyard that makes it easier for me to make tea with the plant's leaf and drip its full nutritional benefits. When your moringa tree has gotten nice and tall and has significant number of branches, cut the main trunk of your moringa tree down about one meter high. This will keep the tree bushier and easy to harvest in the future. Don't worry, cutting it short won't kill it. Collect all the branches into a pile, tie 10 pieces together at their base, and hang them. Keep them out of the sun. Air drying takes about 3 days. After the third day, the leaves will become melted and will be ready for crushing. Collect the dried moringa leaves into a ball or onto a sheet. Hint, minimize the amount of small sticks in the mix. It will make for a smoother powder. Hand drying removes the moisture to make the leaves brittle. The process deactivates oxidative enzymes and prevents the leaves from rotting. The application of heat also stops the growth of molds. This is a delicate step and proper care must be followed to ensure that the leaves will retain their flavor and nutritional value. Place the pan over low fire and allow it to get warm. For about 1 to 2 minutes, pour the dried leaves into the pan and continuously turn them over for about 3 minutes. Quickly remove and completely dry leaves from the pan and place them in a clean open container to cool. Place the leaves in a blender or grinder until the desired consistency is achieved. Moringa tea is best stored in an airtight glass container. This is done to minimize oxidization, increase shelf life, and retain the full flavor of the brew.
when brewing, it is best to not boil the leaves so you can get full nutritional benefits from malunggay tea. What you need to do is tip 2 teaspoon of malunggay tea in boiling water. Allow the leaves to settle at the bottom of the cup before drinking the brew. You can add honey or sugar to the brew if you want a sweet tasting tea.